Well, hey there, YouTube. Today we're out exploring this old, uh, I guess it's an old mill site, mine mill site. And uh, seems to be pretty extensive from what I can see. It's getting, getting late in the day, but I'm going to get a little video and we'll come out here again in the future. All right, folks, so here's what's out here, kind of off in the distance. Looks like a portal to a mine there. There's some tailings there, so you can see what came out of it. It's late in the day. We're going to have to come back here early and explore this place. Well, folks, here's a steel ball from a ball mill. That is heavy. About the size of a baseball. That's what they would use to break all the ore down. So there's got to be a ball mill around here somewhere. A lot of people will find these that are worn down a lot more than this. And they'll post them on eBay and try to sell them as a Civil War, um, uh, whatever you call them, projectiles, balls, whatever they are. A lot of people fall for that. Bud. Some type of operation was taking place here. That there's in ruins. There's a big tub here. Uh, it's made out of wood. Held together by those big metal bars that go around it. They had a liner in it at some point. I bet whatever it is, it's all leaked into the soil around here. Sure is quiet out here. Well, we're getting a little closer there. Look at that. Well, here's the remains of an old concrete foundation. I'm sure they had another building here at some point. Folks, stop coming out to these places and destroying them. If people keep destroying them, then uh, we're not future generations. Your children aren't going to be able to come out here and see what's going on. Right, I'm just trying to get some quick footage here until we come out here next time. Just a little teaser. It's definitely big out here. There's a lot of stuff to explore. Well, here we go, folks. Check out this place. Too bad the vandals have broken the windows out of here. Isn't that cool? Check out the motor on this thing. Big old pulleys. Still has a couple belts on it. Those are big belts. Quite a bit of stuff in here.
Look at that. Still have an old tractor in there. Some type of engine there. What is that? A four cylinder diesel there. Looks like it's uh, coupled up to a generator head. Now this is neat to come out here and document this because this is all going to be destroyed, stolen. Um, it's all going to be, you know, someone's going to come out here and take all this and auction it off. It, it, it never fails. Tanks of propane and probably oxygen and acetylene and all kinds of other stuff here. Check out these old window panes here. That's terrible, someone broke them. So my partner in crime just brought this over. I believe those are insulators off of a uh, power pole or something there. Pretty cool. Well folks, those things I just showed you, those are the insulators for up there on the power pole. You can see them. Well folks, here's the same little machine shop and someone has broken the door open here. Look at that door. Boy, that would that would be awesome just to refinish that and do something with it. Unfortunately, since someone's been in here, um, things are going to be getting stolen. Look at that. An old Montgomery Ward cement mixer there. Um, can't really tell what this is here. Drill press. Oh, this is when equipment was made was made right. Go ahead and look in here. I'm not going to walk in any further than this, though. Uh, yeah, you can see someone. I'm sure, they had a lock on there, and someone probably broke it. Another old foundation here. There was a little bird that flew by. See the valley down there. Boy, lots of neat stuff here. Here's the door to this building that somebody's ripped off. It's a cool looking door. Here's where that door goes. I'm not going to be able to film much in there with this particular phone. It's not good in low light. It's just a little cheapy to, so I don't kill the battery in my main one. The bird over there on the window right there you can see. A lot of manuals and parts catalogs and stuff in here. Probably scaring that poor little bird there. Still lots of parts in these shelves, in these little cubby holes here. It's okay, little bird. I'm going to leave. Here, I guess you can leave first. You can tell it's been ransacked. People have taken a lot of stuff out of here, unfortunately. Probably won't be able to see too much of this due to the low light. But I figured what the heck. Alright, here's the outside of this building we are just in.
So here's a couple of military crates. And uh, someone screwed them together with some L brackets and made some little type of thing for it there. Definitely pretty neat. Could be some cool yard art. See what it says there. It's three cartridge, 81 millimeter, four mortars, M1 and M29. Three rockets, heat, 3.5 inch, M28A2. It's pretty cool right there. And then here's some stuff out here in the distance. We're not going to make it to there today, but uh. Looks like they've got an old dozer over there and uh, possibly might have some good stuff over there in that uh, metal building. Who knows if it's locked up or not. We'll walk over there next time, see what's going on. Hear how quiet it is out here? All right, here we go here. Here's this, uh, I guess you'd call this a big head frame. I guess that's what that's called. Got the cables going down to the other room. I'll show you in a minute. I guess that's where the winches were, I'm guessing. We can see what's in here real quick. All right, folks, it's pretty dark in here, but uh, let's give you a little view of what's in here. Sorry for the low light conditions. Looks like some dice for something there, something or another, or maybe they're they got the wheels they put on there. There's a vent right there. Here we go. This is really cool. Some old narrow gauge rail. Look at this. And it's running up over there. That's really cool right there. Okay, here's the next little building over. Got that old desk there in the drawers. And check out that I-beam right there, huh? Obviously to heat this place right there. Cool little door right here. Look at that door. It's really neat. Here's this narrow gauge rail again here. I'm sure it was much more expansive in the past. Look at where it continues on the... If you want to call that an elevator? I'm not sure. Sure, it originally went down the shaft there. Who knows how deep that shaft is? We'll have to get a light down there next time and see. It's definitely really cool though, looking upward. All right, folks, we're looking at the cables coming down here. They go into this building here. There's those massive winches right there. Look at that. Big old motor. We'll try to explore this better next time.
They definitely had power here. There's that Nevada, northern Nevada sunset starting to appear there. There's the other side of that head frame there. Check that out. Look at all that timber there. Well, folks, we'll get more of this next time. We'll make sure to document it fairly well. Is that beautiful sky? But for now, this will be the end of this one. Hope you all enjoyed it. Desert Explorer 302, out.